welcome to an unpredicted school year. My name is Mr. Garcia and I am your host. Today we will be talking about a very fond teacher of the Franklin High community. This teacher recently joined our staff two years ago, but this does not mean she's not important. She came to Franklin with their head held high, coming from a different school and not knowing how Franklin was. However, she managed to get through it and made her stay at Franklin permanent. Every day since she came to Franklin, she came with the same positive attitude and amazing humor. Never thinking about herself, the moment she stepped foot into Franklin, her focus was on the students and only the students. This allows her to fulfill her full potential as a great teacher, always helping the kids and always pushing them to be their best selves. Let's hear from one of our students. Hi, Chani. How has Ms. Panucci positively influenced you at school? A way Ms. Panucci positively influenced me at school was making me feel comfortable in being who I'm able to be and expressing myself freely. Now, let's speak to the one and only Ms. Panucci. Thank you so much for being with us here today. Our first question is, why did you become a teacher? become a teacher back probably in high school, um, sophomore, junior, senior year. My favorite class was always math, always. I just like the fact that there's always an answer. Um, I, I don't like having to guess. I like the fact that there's a way to do a problem and you could get an answer. Who has influenced you as a teacher? My AP calculus teacher that I had in high school. Her name was Miss Sarno. She was a younger teacher, but not super young. Um, but she really made math uh, fun for everybody. It was Due to COVID-19, school shut down March 13th, 2020. All students and staff were sent home for what we thought was only going to be two weeks. Those two weeks turned into a whole year that we've been out. We have covered how it affects students and even our athletic director, Ms. Cortez. However, we are missing the most important people at our school, the teachers. Ms. Panucci certainly didn't go to school to teach her students via Zoom. Let's hear how she feels about this. How has teaching been different during COVID-19? And the main reason is not having that personal one-on-one -one -one interaction that I can have in a classroom. I can walk around the room and each student can be in a different spot and with different abilities in the problem. And I can look at their work and I can look at it and see what do they know? What do they not know? And, and I know how to fix it. Here, I don't. I don't see faces. I don't know what students are working on. Um, and it's really been a struggle because I think students are getting frustrated and I don't actually know what is wrong. Or I don't know how to help them. What else changed in your life because of COVID-19? I have uh, most of my family that lives in Wisconsin in the Midwest, because I just moved to LA four years ago, and we can't really travel. Um, my brother and sister-in-law do live in California, and I can see them, but both of us have to quarantine for two weeks before we go. How do you think COVID-19 has affected your students? I mean, if this lockdown has been difficult on me, it's even more difficult on students. I mean, they're not even adults yet and they have to deal with the no socialization. A lot of them have family members that have had COVID. They've had COVID and they, they don't even know how to manage their time very well because no one's really been able to teach them how to do school online. Do you feel comfortable going back to school? And I, I think I do as long as you know certain safety precautions are put in place for example tomorrow i'm getting my first vaccination which i'm pretty excited about and then i'll get the next one a few weeks later so as long as you know there's safety procedures then i feel like i would feel pretty comfortable coming back to school thank you so much miss panucci for your time and dedication to teaching nothing goes unnoticed as you can tell, Ms. Panucci's life has been greatly affected drastically due to COVID-19. However, her perseverance had made her stronger than ever. Thank you for watching and make sure to check out the Franklin News Network.